Hello, hello, hello. Thanks for joining me. Enjoying a little bit of a sunset here. Outside of Chicago. Thank you, thank you. It's one of my favorite spots here, very peaceful. The lake is calm today. And we've had a wonderful day here in Chicago. It was probably near 75 degrees. I haven't caught track, but it was warm today. Very peaceful location here. Sometimes I'll come out here and uh, there'll be a variety of birds here in the water as well. But I don't see them right now because they're probably sitting on their nests. Thank you for viewing it. I appreciate that. Thanks for sharing it. I do have my location turned on, so if you wanted to check out the location, you'll see exactly. Hello, Genuine David, how you doing? Thanks for coming out and checking this out. This particular area is uh, near the Palis Park Forest Preserve. Thank you, I appreciate that. Thanks for the hearts, I appreciate that. Yeah, it's a, it's a peaceful location here where I come out here on a regular basis. Hello Leonard, how you doing? Thanks for joining here. Came out to my lake here and just you know, watch the sun go down in the horizon. This area actually is part of the glacier formation when the last ice age that came through here 10,000 years ago. Very, very relaxing though, very relaxing. Minimal wind, how can you beat it? 75 degrees today. And tomorrow is supposed to be a mere image, if not a little bit warmer. Thank you for the hearts, I appreciate that. There's also an osprey. Hello, how you doing there? Thank you for, I'm having a hard time a little bit to see who's coming on board here a little bit. There's an osprey nest here also that's nearby here. I'll just zoom over for a second, let you take a look. right there and they are in fact sitting on it I've seen both the parents there all the time so it's kind of a nice backdrop here okay let's see if we get ourselves refocused here again Thank you for watching everybody. I appreciate that. Thank you for the hearts, most definitely. It's a beautiful day here for me to come out and relax. Great print. Hello, how you doing? I'm very sorry. I can't see who's coming here. Who's coming on board here? 
I know it doesn't look like the sun. Well, you know, with this new update here, the sun. It's a little bit darker here on my screen here. Ah, I see. There we go. I see Ann's on board there. Hello, Ann. How you doing there in the distance? Yeah, this is a great spot here just to come and relax. And often there will, yes, it's, it is a great view. Yeah, it's very, very peaceful. There are other parking lots, but it would be from the other end of it, so. I'm doing well, thank you. It was a great day today. Took advantage of the 75 degrees, if not warmer today than it was, and did yard work, so. Now I'm chilling out, relaxing. I come out to this location a little bit, but uh, you know I go to a variety of spots throughout Chicago. I just haven't uh, been on the go here lately. But I will be soon, so if you would like to follow me, feel free, and I'll be showing you a few crazy things. I've lived in the area here over 40 years here, so I, I know Chicago fairly well. But I do like the forest preserve. I like the peacefulness. The lake water is still 42, 43 degrees, so it's rather chilly downtown Chicago right now. But it will be getting warmer. Wow, you have a sister in Chicago. Good for you. Actually, where I'm at here is probably about 20 miles west of Chicago. Very relaxing atmosphere out here. Thank you for the hearts. I appreciate that. Who's ever being real generous there? Very nice. I do appreciate it. Many more beautiful is it is on Lake Michigan. Well, Lake Michigan is, is, is very, very nice. You know, if you're there in the morning, you can catch it coming over the lake. And when I'm out on my boat, it's you can catch uh, the sunsets pretty good out on the lake. Very nice, very relaxing. Unfortunately, the, the boat is not as calm as it is right here, right now. Right, exactly, yep. Yeah. If you're down on the south side of Lake Huron, that is, or the Oh, very good. Well, they're out on the boat. Maybe they're going to be fishing and uh, enjoying themselves. Sounds like a great thing. I'll be doing that too here in another few weeks. I did see that. I saw Denver got a foot of snow today. Yep, I did see that on the news, so that was incredible. Well, we're supposed to have sunny skies in Chicago for the next week here, so it looks like it's going to be very good weather here. It's about time, that's all I have to say, because we've had a more than our share of cool weather the last three weeks. So... I got a lot of work outside my house to catch up on. Every year, same thing. Very nice, very relaxing. Right, well, this, this year, even in Chicago, we had snow, but very minimal, and when it did snow, it was very slushy and uh, minimal accumulation. I think the biggest community, we might have had a five inch, maybe an eight inch dump at one spot, but uh, it was actually a mild winter. Very relaxing. Well, that sun is really falling fast, I'll tell you. But 
Uh, just we're on the right side of summer right now. The days are going to progressively get longer and longer for the next two months. So I can't wait for it to stay light out until 9 o'clock. Yeah, we're on the right side of the year right now. I got some giggly girls here a few feet over. Uh, obviously, I'm not at the... The only person here at this this scenic outlook here, so, so it's a great spot. Very nice. Hello, Tom. Thanks for joining us here. Right outside of Chicago, about 20 miles. Enjoy it. It's the after sunset portion right now. Or the, the skies turning all different types of shades. You see some of the contrails out from the jets. It is a popular spot here, yeah. And uh, it's amazing on how many people come out for a sunset. It's uh, it's mesmerizing. Uh, a lot of people like sunrises, but it takes a certain person to be out early in the morning to catch the sunrise. Sunset's a little easier. It's a, it's a great spot here. Probably one of the best here in the in the western suburbs. And I appreciate all the hearts, everybody, and all the generosity. It's uh, very nice. Yeah, you have to get up early. There's several scopers out there, and uh, I, I give them credit for getting themselves out in the morning. Personally, I am a morning person, but uh, unfortunately, my, my work activity is interfering with my personal life, and I hate when that happens. So I have to keep my attention on work in the morning. I'm in the construction equipment business, so. Very, very relaxing here, that's for sure. Yeah, there's a small fish here that just jumped near me here. There are several fish here on this lake here, but it's uh, mainly smaller fish. And hopefully it's going to No, I do not speak French. Uh, <laughs> just English. And you can get up any time, but it's a little too late to get up at 5 a.m. I agree. That that takes, you know, you got to have uh, access to being getting your camera out right away as soon as you get out of bed. Yeah, this is much more relaxing right now. I would like to have a few cocktails right now, but they don't allow them at this particular location, so I'm not going to ask for trouble. I'll catch that when I get home, and I'll start my fire. i got a fire pit that I'll get going in the evening here in a little bit, so take advantage of that. Well, I think I'm going to wind this one down, folks. I appreciate you following here and catching up with me. So uh, I will continue another day. I hope everybody has a great evening tonight and make the best of it. Go drink some coffee before you do anything. <laughs> well, thank you very much, everybody. I really appreciate everybody watching here tonight. So. Thanks again. I appreciate uh, the hearts, and uh, I really enjoy this. So I hope everybody else has a good time uh, doing their own periscopes as well. Good night now. Great now. Have a nice night.